You're listening to Curious and Interesting, a two-minute podcast on what's new and intriguing in the world of advertising research. I'm Dr. Barbara Phillips, editor of the Journal of Current Issues and Research in Advertising. Brand safety refers to ensuring that a brand's ads do not appear adjacent to offensive content that can damage the advertised brand. The issue of brand safety has arisen because of programmatic advertising for buying digital ads. This means that ads are automatically placed on the internet based on the viewer's characteristics. No human is involved in checking the content the ad is placed beside. This can lead to unforeseen problems, such as in 2021 when the shareholders of Home Depot requested it investigate whether its automatic ad bides inadvertently help commit human rights violations by funding platforms spreading hateful content. Researchers Lee Kim and Lim used two experiments to investigate what happens when a brand's ads accidentally appear beside offensive content on social media. Does the negative content spill over onto the ads? In study one, participants were exposed to an ad that was adjacent to an offensive social media post of animal abuse. Half of the participants saw an ad for a product associated with animals, for pet food, and half saw an ad for an unrelated product, for an educational service. Participants who saw the pet food ad felt more negative emotion toward the brand and assigned more blame for the ad placement to the brand than participants who saw the unrelated ad. Pet food participants also indicated they would engage in spreading negative word of mouth for the pet food brand, suggesting they believed the pet food brand implicitly approved or overlooked its ad placement next to offensive content. Study 2 used the same method as Study 1, but the offensive social media post contained misogynistic content. The associated product ad was for a woman's pain reliever, while the non-associated product ad was for an educational service. In addition, each ad was varied to be more or less intrusive. Intrusive ads are usually good ads because they're noticed more by consumers. The results of Study 2 were the same as Study 1. The ad for the woman's pain reliever led to more negative emotions, more blame attribution, and more negative word of mouth. In addition, the intrusiveness of the ad increased these negative effects, suggesting that the more a brand's ad is successful in getting noticed, the worse it is for the brand to be accidentally associated with offensive content. The researchers conclude that even a brand's inadvertent association with offensive content can make consumers believe that the brand implicitly approved or carelessly overlooked its ad placement. Furthermore, the negative spillover effects of brand safety violations are especially bad when the ad intrusiveness is high. This research provides advertisers with strong rationale for being vigilant in safeguarding their brands by vetting online content before placing their ads. For more information, this research paper was published in the 2021 issue of the Journal of Current Issues and Research in Advertising.